Greetings, Dennis Daniels here. This is find a job using browser use. Let's go ahead and fire up our terminal. Control shift tilde uh, python.examples find a job.py. And in a moment, hopefully everything will work. Uh, so browser use identifies all of the items on the screen and then numbers them and then it will in this case go to the careers site find the career site and it dies with a bunch of errors uh, which I'm going to pass to Klein C-L-I-N-E and I'm going to tell Klein update this code, extract um, all of the available jobs, save the job data as a JSON file, name the file, date, site, dot json so let's put that in there date and uh, be let's be very specific use your year month month date date and let's see what happens now because I'm using Klein, Klein has some instructions about using memory bank. So it might actually create the memory bank files before it writes the code uh, to extract the, uh, the number of jobs. All right, so right here you can see result, number of jobs, parse jobs, URL history. Let's see what happens. Uh, wants to read the file. I approve that. It's making the API request. I'm using Open Router to handle the requests because uh, theoretically, Open Router is smart enough to use uh, the correct LLM for the complexity of the particular task. Anthropic Claude is really good, uh, but I don't want to pay for it every time it's just doing simple fixes. Uh, you can see I'm already up to 12 cents here for the API costs. And now, uh, let's see if it's... Uh, well, I got a uh, I got a new error here. Not sh I've never seen this error before. Of course, when you're doing a live demo, that's what you're going to get. Hmm. Okay, so it's doing it's checking the source code for this particular browser use. I forked browser use, so we're looking at more or less the same code that's on GitHub right now. Klein's checking it to see what, where these errors might be coming from. And we might be on a fool's errand to get this code to work as I want it, which is to extract the data as a JSON file. And now we're still running and we're at 21 cents. Okay, because it's pedantic. All right. Yeah, I've noticed this a few times. Uh, browser use 
for whatever reason, V2 and V1 errors keep coming up. I don't know why. And we're still chunking along here. Save. And hi, Dan. Check sure we're shooting the correct methods. Correct methods, yes, okay, that's always a good idea. Approve. Okay, use a simpler structure and yeah, we're, we're getting into uh, an AI tailspin here, I think. It's not, it doesn't look like it's going to work. We'll give it one more shot. Reject that, and we're going to try running the code one more time. I'm going to run the code. Oh, maybe the code wasn't saved, so I'm not sure what's going to happen. And you can see that it's starting the process in the background. Okay, so we've got a bunch of deprecation errors. We saw that. Uh, model not found. Okay, so has been deprecated. Uh, I need to update. Oh, right, because it changed my. See, this is where Klein will go in and mess with stuff that already works. And it's not letting me. Okay, so let's try to edit this. It's not, oh, it's not letting me edit. Why is it not letting me edit? Reject, and I'm going to go back over here uh, because it's using the wrong model. Right there. Let's see if I can edit this now. There we go. GPT 4.0, Control S. And I don't think anything else has changed in here, but we'll go ahead and give it a try one more time. Uh, clear and Let's bring this over to the side, see if we can catch any of these errors. Okay, uh, no joy. Uh, did not produce what we, what I wanted, which was Currently no job openings, it says it states no openings, but in fact that's not the case. If we go back to our anthropic careers,
open rolls right there, and there's plenty. Uh, so that's browser use. Thanks for watching. If it was useful, please let me know. Thanks for watching. Happy computing.